Hey there, coin community. So today I'm going to teach you how to use copper coins um, to attribute your dive varieties and find the values of your coins. So we'll go over here to the dive variety search, 1960, then hit Denver because that's what we're looking for. This is a mint mark variety, so we're going to go ahead and submit the search. And we scroll down to RPM4. And as you guys can see right here, RPM4 Copper Coins does a wonderful job at showing the values of the coin determined by grade. All right, so we're going to go over here to an EDS. And this is the coin that I have right here. So I'm going to go ahead and zoom in. So as you guys can see, this is a 1960D and it's RPM4. It says it is the most difficult 1960D. Repunch mint mark to obtain. It's only known in EDS and MDS. There's two small hooks that protrude from the northwest corner of the mint mark. So that would be right here. Anyway, um, that's the coin that I'm showing down there in the smaller view. So if you look right here, you can see this as a die dot. That is a marker. Um, if we go down here, you guys can see die scratches. Those are all mar also markers. In order to um, attribute a die variety, uh, you need to make sure that all of your die markers match. So this is just showing more die markers. Um, here we go, you guys can see that there. There's some die scratches. But anyway, um, I, let's go over here to the value information. So I get a lot of questions about, well, how much is it worth? Well, if it's not an FS listed variety and you can't look up the uh, value on PCGS, go ahead and come on over here to Copper Coins. And um, Chuck does his best to keep up with the value information. So if you found this coin and it was graded MS63, that's $90. If it's MS65, that's worth $120 just for this little mint mark variety here. So if you have any other questions or concerns, go ahead and get a hold of me. Um, you can PM me on here or find me on Facebook. Um, you guys have a wonderful day.